Well, coming back this morning, that's the last thing we need, just a little bit of moisture. It don't show up really on the map, so it's gotta be less than a 10. If it's anything just other than what just a dry drizzle is all it is. <laughs> that's what Big Daddy always used to say. <laughs> oh, come on now. Please don't be wetter. Uh, in there. There's where we cut yesterday evening. No, I don't know. I can't tell. It, it damn sure didn't dry out last night through the night. I promise you that. We got some on this knob. And then today, unless I got to babysit them because they can't get through the mess over there, I'm going to have to cut all these ones here today. Which should be pretty easy. It cutting wise is a piece of damn cake today. I could probably go down there and work on that crossing, but the skidders don't need to slow down and play at the crossing unless it's absolutely necessary because uh we don't really need the downtime of moving wood to fart with it. You know, we need the wood moving. Is what we're gonna need today. That's what are necessary. Oh no, it's fine. It just made a little bit of moisture on top, that's all. Clamp, did I? I got the clamp. Okay. And I'll probably need a socket for it, won't I? So things was clicking along quite well today, and then, uh, until Tiny gave out on Derek a little bit. He felt bad about what happened to Blackie the other day, so. <laughs> Had to make it even. <laughs> Derek said, I'm going down there. He said, I'm like, boy, that fog's moving off fast. <laughs> he said, hell, it was me. <laughs> Following me down across the field. <laughs> and this ain't the hose that's supposed to go on it. But we're going to make it work. I was going to tell the guy these hoses on these Volvos. Are, they always told me it's Belopian tubes. <laughs> <laughs> so Cat didn't have any Belopian tubes, so we had to put a cat hose on it. Although it's probably not going to be perfect, but... Found it worked better than the other one. Yeah, the other one had a hole in it. Let me, uh, whew, let me shorten this up here. Oh, oh where's my tater tool? Uh, oh, I was going to say, usually I keep that thing around close somewhere. Don't leave home without it. This is where I'm going to end up stabbed. Of course, everybody's getting along pretty damn good. We're going to win this. I was worried, man. I was worried about this. Really getting worried. I think it'll work. <laughs> it ain't gonna win no beauty prize. <laughs> so, here's the dilemma. So the hose that come off of it had a hump in it. Where you, but you still, it's still rubbing there. And this hose don't have the hump. It's just a standard hose. Which I told Derek after we're sitting there at McAllister's, I said, uh, Actually, I think I got that hose in the back of my truck now that you mention it. But we had to get the water come from McAllister's to mix or mix back together so where we could remix the fluid. If it don't work, we can always flip this in here over and run. Yeah, run yeah. So, way. yeah, so here's here's the cover. <laughs> I asked Derek, I said, hell, well, if we flipped it over and, well, it, yeah. Because this was on the bottom, see. <laughs> yeah, if we put it on the top yeah we put it on the top it'd be all yeah it was just funny he goes as i thought boy it's awful foggy out this morning and it's traveling pretty quick <laughs> uh, cut late last night just to make sure that i cross the ditches on the ground just nervous i want to win i want to get this all to the boom dad's got to go in for some dude dad tomorrow or monday You know what I mean? And we're going to rain the weekend. I want to have everything sitting in the yard. So we know we got this job one. Okay. All right, we're going to start dumping. Ooh. what she does 
Maybe it'll go down that way. She come across them mats a while ago with Patty. Drops off in between one of the mats. She said, that bridge is rough. I wouldn't cross that thing. I don't think I hurt the truck, but she said I wouldn't cross it with that truck. Me and Derek drives out there and she missed the mat. She fell off the mat with the tire. Lord knows what happened to the truck. We're gonna win this. I think we can win this. We don't need no more breakdowns. But I think we can win this. I think. I think without a doubt we can win this. Robin is the big show in town. Him and Derek are the big show in town. Now Derek's okay with his breakdown because he can still out haul what we can do by a chunk. And as long as Robin can chuck the wood on him, man, they could, if they get down to the seating the last hour or two where he's just chucking wood on him like crazy, it, it, the wood will still fly out of here. So either way, we've got this by the bag as long as we can keep from having breakdowns. God, I love that truck. Go get him, Derek. Derek said I'm caught up on bands. Well, he's not caught up on bands, but he said he's got his new bands in from Olsen. He really likes the Olsen bands. Um, but him and Mommy ordered a bunch of bands for the resaw. And because it's Corona mess, we Olsen's bands. Olsen's bands are now going to be... Uh, a year out so I told him mommy I said you all need to order some go ahead and order more bands for next year I said go ahead and get some Simon's bands in there because Simon's ain't out that far I don't think I don't know we'll find out but Olsen's out almost a year and uh, so I said you well, they added eight bands come in and uh, I said get 
get uh, you all might want to get like four simon's bands sitting there to get you to the next round of olsen bands coming in no i don't know i don't know it's operator preference or what but they, they'd rather work with the olsen bands Derek would and i've heard that for years Derek and them they like them olsen bands i don't know i got a ways to cut i don't know That's the thing about Big D, man. He likes production. That guy. In this industry, you kind of got, which that's kind of inside information, but you kind of got pitchers and takers. Or, you know, pushers and, pushers and followers, kind of, so to speak. I don't know how you say that. You got people that pushes the production, Roger, Rob, and Derek, all three of them pushes production. They just want that, they want that product moving. When it's not moving, they're not happy. So whatever they're running, you can but you can set your clock by that sun bucks moving. Now you get a guy likes to lean around, talk, stand lean, you gotta watch that. I don't know how we've done it, but we ended up with a company full of people likes moving the production. And I'm not complaining, I promise you. Speaking of moving production, we're sitting here talking and leaning right now ourselves. Let's get to work. All right, so it's turn to find out that somebody, probably one of you guys, talked to Murphy. And Murphy started poking his little head around. And we found out today, today was the day that we found out Murphy's going to be a dick today. So betwixt the hose on Tiny and now the hose on Brutus. But Murphy, I don't think you're gonna win today, buddy. I think you're gonna try. I think you're gonna win the battle, Murphy, but I don't think you're gonna win the war. Oh yeah. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, oh. His name is Murphy. He's a dick. His name is Murphy and he's a dick. His name is Murphy. Where's my hammer go? Where did my hammer go? My name is Murphy. All right, speaking for Murphy. Not me, I'm not a dick. I'm a nice person, Murphy. I'm not the guy you do this to. Oh, hey, hanging Murphy, come on. Oh, come on, Murphy, come on. Oh, that ain't gonna work at all. I'm gonna hit my hand. Oh. Ooh. Come on, Murphy. Oh, you ain't won yet. You've been battling all week. Can you give me a break, Murphy? Come on, old buddy. Where you old buddy, Lord? Hey, come on, Murphy. Son of a biscuit. Mm, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, oh, right on my leg, bud. Oh, yeah, I hold my britches, bud. Come on, hot. Why not, why not? Well, let me go crimp a hose and bring it back here, get Betty. I'll put her on there, Murphy. Ah, hell with it. Uh, Shoo, Brutus. That sucks, buddy. Next, I need to get it spun around. Trucker. 
that's the only problem with these flat face fittings. What is going on? Okay, so here's my dilemma. That's wobbly. These flat face fittings, my only beef with flat face fittings is they're so good that when you get something pops and busts something loose, what's going to loosen up is not going to be the flat face. It's going to be the JIC fitting on the inside, which is what we run into here. Can be a turd i'll give it to you but you're my turd and i love you you're that broody brute i love you buddy now you're gonna be nice to me the rest of the day if i change your little hose for you you gonna be nice little booty boot hi buddy buddy murphy's law strikes again robin's got a fuel issue up a hose on tiny for blow on so we should be in good shape Murphy, Murphy's been a dick all day I had to change the hose on Brutus I just got him running a minute ago well like, here's one of them things that yeah I said, Does this thing have a history? well I didn't even well I'm learning what I got it yeah I know what's about that. Just now I think it should be poor now there. You would think it should. But there again, I don't know. Is that water or fuel? That's water, ain't it? It looks like water. I just kind of got thrown in here with no instruction. I know. He's done great. That's good. No, he ain't. Yeah, yeah. They went from clear to red yeah, there. Yeah, that's fuel. Okay. And there's a hose, I think it's this one that you got, I think it's this one that you got to blow back into. Or here, take uh, this, one of these, it, that's it, one of these. Really? Yeah, and then uh, and you well, blow back it. in, and it'll blow it uh, back to the tank. Well, I guess I'll try that one. Is that right? I don't know. I, I've been here, done this a thousand, a couple, a few times. A few times. But I can't. I've slipped since then. Now I've got that screwed up. Yeah, that's cross threaded. Here's your wrenches. Here, I'll let you do it. Uh, uh, go get Allen, Allen wrenches. Allen wrenches. Uh, uh, Roger knows. Well, you know where. What's the the red ones. The red ones? Uh, yeah. Uh, when you put no, I don't. Yeah, I'll keep this. I'll keep this in case. Maybe we were we supposed to. Put the that that on. Okay. No. No, just hold off on that for a minute. Okay. Let's get this going. Robin's the biggest show in town. This ain't no good. I know. I just screwed it on there until it quit leaking and no, called it good. It ain't good. Ah. It's all right. Well, goddamn, you did get it. It ain't leaking. You lucky ass. All right. Uh, 
think it's here. Hey, we're gonna try that one. Okay. Hey, we'll know if we explode the fuel. Yeah. This. How much air is Tony Bell? What a bit. <laughs> Blow that air radiator hose. Here you go. <laughs> hey. While I'm right here, I'm gonna air that fucking hot dog up. <laughs> Your big red old cow. I seen that. Why don't you bring another one out with it? I thought about it, but I thought oh. I played the green skin in one hand and both of them pushing me back. Oh, the you, you'd be pulling them both too bad. Okay. <laughs> yeah. You wanted to slow down now and keep up with you, right? Okay. Yeah, because mine, that generator is different from that green one with mine. Hey, can't be that big adjustable wrench. This stuff is in quite big. And it just don't know if it takes the inch of five sixteenths. I got inch of four. When I'm I'm in third or fourth gear, and they be you're a, higher geared. Yeah. Yep. You know, yeah, you know, you're higher geared. I figured. <laughs> right there, right with you see, I laid a cherry up where we're gonna set the pile. There's a cherry set out there, but I figured we'd put the whole pile right there. Okay. No, it's right straight there. You'll see it. Uh, I figured we'd bring all these back to it. Yeah. And we'd stoke us up a great big pile, and all that wood would go in that pile. Which Robin will be over there pretty quick. This is good. That's it? That's it. I was going to film you guys coming up that hill. <laughs> a little late, wasn't I? Yeah. Good great. Take a nap. Take a nap. this here. I think I took that off and then I'd blow in it. I'm just getting the gun down here for a call. Yep. Oh, you and me both. That'll get me. Thank you. Yeah. Do what? It's cutting ball too again. Yeah. I figured it's just a matter of time until we busted through what we had. How deep do you reckon that is? I don't know. Yeah. See, that should be gushing out the way I remember it. All right, here goes nothing. I think that did it, Wade. Yeah. <laughs> Son of a biscuit. How are you going to do Yeah. Somebody stick their finger in it, the canoe's sinking. <laughs> Got a squirter. <laughs> you ever seen that guy? He stuck his finger in that canoe and then he'd pop out, start leaking in another spot. <laughs> well, yeah, in a cartoon. <laughs> that should get you. Oh, what size is that? I need to get one of them. Keep it in my fucking toolbox. Here. Them's extra. And you get your new toolbox if you want to roll these, just let me know. I don't know how big your box is or how much you're wanting. All right, Morgan. You're a good man. A gentleman and a scholar. What's the plan down here on this Okay. I got a cherry tree set out in the field right there. Yeah. That's the pile. All this shit, we just need to start here like we did this time and pull that down so when Robin pulls up, everything's passing. And then the rest of it will come out in and feed that pile. There's a drain spot in the field. Big yeah. Daddy said we had to get out in the field and go around it. You'll see it's over, straight crow flies right straight that way. Boy, you got food in there. Yeah. We'll see. Nope. It ought to do you fine. I'm sure. Probably once every year it, it finally acts uh, up. No, now that I know that that's been a known issue, I'll just. Yeah. I think I ran it 
it without the cap. I lost the cap one day, and it was when I was first running. When you're first running this, you'll get sawdust. You, you know how you're getting more used to it? Oh, I was fresh uh, on it. I lost the cap, and I drove it all day without the cap on. And ever since then, it's been a problem. All right, now we'll get rocking and rolling. I tell you, I have done... <clears throat> This definitely, I don't even feel like this would be tooting my own horn. I have done a lot of stuff, boys. <laughs> and with my brain power, I'm the type of guy I shouldn't have done a lot of stuff. <laughs> so, back when I was learning how to run that thing, I had uh, got spazzed out one day, let the fuel cap off. And of course, when you don't know how to run it yet, you get a lot of sawdust on it. Like your saw will kick up a lot of dust and then it's eating, you're eating sawdust. It's getting in the filters, getting in the radiator, getting in the, well, when you leave the fuel cap off, it'll be getting in the fuel tank too. Well, like three days later, the son of a buck started acting up on me and I finally had to blow back in the fuel tank. That bottom went bad, it was, it was bad. Now, we thought about crossing this bottom and coming through here, but we decided not to. We got a plenty of wood coming up and we're just gonna put it up in that corner. Now I need to get to work because uh, I need to get to work because uh, they're gonna be wrong my butt. Anybody want a tent? You can pitch a tent. Put you up a pup tent. All right. Let's get back to work. Broody broot, tooty fruity, a broody broody, tooty fruity. Broody broody, tooty fruity. Tooty fruit, broody broot. Fruity fruity, fruity fruity. Wet bam 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 bam. Got a tree, gonna cut it. Then Robin's gonna truck it. Got a tree, gonna cut it. Gonna load it up and truck. What the hell? Wop bop wop 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 boom bam. All right. I'll shut this off and we'll get to whack a lacking. I wanted to get Roger come up that hill with the red Morgan. open. Thank you, Bill. Reach out of them. Yeah, Morgan. Roger for about a half hour. I'll get all this stuff done. All righty, guys. Hold that. Come over here. So, but yeah, uh, whatever you need help, I'll just come grab me and get them closer. You are a good man, Morgan. Gentleman and a scholar, Robin. That's what he is. <laughs> Morgy, Porgy, Porgy. Oh, this is a scholar and a gentleman. I'd say he was a gentleman way before he turned into a scholar. <laughs> I ain't too damn sure about either one at the moment. <laughs> You hear that, Morgan? Haters gonna hate. <laughs> Robin just set them standards too high. Yeah. yeah, Robin just got too high standards. Yeah, well, I'm telling. Hell, he'll have to pull another one out up before he's over with. <laughs> Okay. That's what old Tony told us that time, or no, that's old Jeff said that that time. He said, y'all just set your standards too high. He I said, was disappointed in myself, though. God dang it. I got 15 now. But seven minutes with the work left on that stock wall. I wouldn't have that gun for the skitters left. <laughs> Miss her by much. Yeah, goddamn close. Hell, Robin, that fuel filter hadn't have been stopped up, you'd have probably got along a little faster. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna blame it on. Yeah. <laughs> I'm 
blame it on Roger, even though it is Friday. No, Derek, it's 12.44. We can blame it all on Roger now. <laughs> Roger, I think your radio's breaking up, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> All I heard was some squeaking. A nicer guy, Morgan. <laughs> Trying to make him a little shorter, huh? Eh? <laughs> 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 uh, that's why you're so short. I ain't thrown one at him all morning. It's uh, it's past 12, now it's time. <laughs> you want me to go and get two out from underneath that one there, too? Uh, no, you grab this one. Skid and Morgan, it's almost impossible to pull a tree out from under the other ones. They get so hard to pull out, it's ridiculous. was sitting right there. I told him it couldn't have happened to a nicer guy. Oh yeah? About throwed it on one on myself there a second ago. This is gonna suck. Not really much I can help you, is it? Ah, uh, stay back a minute. Let me work on it.
take any notes, Roger? He's being jealous, Morgan, and that's pretty much how it's done right there. <laughs> like I said, I wish I could pick on Roger for a living. I'd make a killing. He just gives me hell. <laughs> They should have put an X on that one. That, that was junky too. But see these foresters, man, when they're marking this stuff, they're comparing the amount of canopy. They're checking on how much sun they want and all that stuff, so they're careful on the trees they pick to go and stuff. It's a pretty in-depth decision to make. sharp teeth now these guys are putting it on me and then uh robin's fuel filter stopped up his fuel line stopped up coming from the fuel tank murphy's tried his best and we ain't out of the water yet but we're getting closer and closer Just fantastic. I hate to brag too soon or be too proud too quick, but uh, this is going to be like a huge victory. We get this job done before this rain gets here. 
We'll get this job done before the rain get down here, Joby. Come on, Joby, get the ball, boy. It's fancy, it's high tech. Yeah. So when I take off driving it, I just put the camera down like <laughs> kind of a rush, ain't it? Huh? Kind of a rush, ain't it? Yeah. Well, I heard the pop and I was like, every time I've heard that, you ran. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to run. You got a black being done back there, Morgan. I just afraid it had enough side lane. I wanted to be pushed on it when we cut it loose. Well, you Morgan, you got a copy. And if it wasn't oh, wide open. Hey, hey, dad's Okay. That should get me. I'll set him up here. You should have a good route. You can knock that little maple out and head straight out that hole. You see that little big tiny maple? Come this way a little bit. Watch that blade, though. Watch that blade. See that little maple? Yeah, right there with that Yeah. Set. Yeah, Morgan, he's good when I tell you. I don't get the option to work with him too often, but I really like that kid. Well, he's a man, he's a grown man now. 38, 28, excuse me, 30, 30, he's about 30, so I mean, I've, I've got too much going on. But, uh, good man. And a nice person. Whoever his mama is, she raised a good man. Yeah, we got a copy on you there. I had to help Tater real quick. Okay, what are we down to back there? Three trees is good. Okay. I was supposed to get an edible today, but I didn't tear anything up. Well, you, you and Roger would be the only two who got an edible. boy. think the rest of us broke shit. I don't see nothing else marked. I'm going to head it in. I'll be right behind you. 
Oh, it feels good to get that last tree out. Man, that felt good. Me and Derek's packed up and done. Ready to maneuver on out of here. All right, let's walk back and check things out. Well, this has been prepped for the rain here. We're getting a half inch of it. Now today's Friday. It's Friday evening, actually. Very seldom does a job end on a Friday, but it, uh, this, well, this job didn't end, but my job cutting did. But this it's gonna rain in, in an hour and a half. Or an hour hour and a half it's gonna start raining it's gonna rain a half inch it's going to well i just got hit with a raindrop so it's gonna rain a half inch we'll get saturday sunday for settle time and then hopefully monday we'll be cutting up that wood back there and trucking it out um uh, and then uh i'm gonna be on the boom monday so We'll see where we're at tomorrow. It's gonna be mill day. We'll be working at the mill every day, working. But tomorrow's gonna be mill day. I'm a nerd. I can listen to a cat pull any day of the week. <laughs> it's stupid. Like y'all might have like TikToks or YouTube bitches or whatever saved that like the stuff you watch. Mine's all just semis pulling stuff, taking off, listening to them smoke, whatever. <laughs> Don't get it, cat boy. I can listen to one of them all day. It's part of being a nerd, I guess. Morgan, I was talking to him. It's been a rough day. It's been a rough. This week's been tough on him because he's learning so much. Dude, he gets frustrated and talks like, well, "What do I do now?" And then somebody'll tell him just something, you know, and then he'll be like, "Well, I still don't understand what you're wanting me to do." I told him, I said, "People pattern." I explained to Morgan. I said, "People pattern. It's human nature." A human brain works off pattern, and especially older human brains, the longer they've been around this world, they pattern more. You know, I said, they're acting like that towards you because, you know, they're just being blunt. They're like, well, go do that. Well, go do that. You know what I mean? 
He said, I don't get it. They, they won't explain. So I said, well, call me and I'll explain it to you. <clears throat> I said, you got to understand, you're doing a great job skidding. And when somebody can skid like you're already skidding, they expect you to already know the things they're talking about because nobody gets to that level that quick. <laughs> he's only been skidding two weeks. <laughs> and he's doing like, he, he skids like somebody that skidded for maybe a year. He ain't been in real hard skidding, but he skids about like somebody that skidded for a year. But I mean, his way his brain works, he figures things out. And he's real thorough. That's the way Morgan is. That's his habits. So everybody's just like, well, go do this. Okay, what is this? <laughs> you know what I mean? And they're like, <laughs> it's funny. It got down to picking up sticks. And then finally he's like, how exactly do you want me to be? <laughs> oh, he cracked me up. But I told him he's happy. I told him, I said, buddy, you are doing freaking fantastic. And, and the reason everybody's being blunt with you and telling you, bam, just do this, do this. I said, the way you're skidding, it seems like you've been here for months, not freaking days. You know what I mean? But I'm going to get this thing fueled up and get the heck out of here. Ah, breaker broker. Come on in there. Leave me a little comment, a little bit of thumbs up there. Good beer.